the radical politics of the what they call the progressives and the socialists has the left the campus and moved to mainstream. It used to be these radical thoughts were sort of confined to universities. But campus conservatives like yourselves have often acted as a, an early warning system so that we'll know about the emerging threats from these actual Marxist, uh, uh, cultural Marxists who've taken over every university administration that I'm aware of, except maybe that Catholic university in um, Ottawa here. But once the progressives and the socialists had been able to successfully silence speech on campus, which we saw with Dr. Peterson, they knew there would be few obstacles to silence the conservative society at every level. So now that cancel culture has effectively silenced people from speaking out, those progressive socialists are moving quickly to put their agenda in place before the public learns about it. And since the start of the pandemic, we've seen governments try to seize more and more power. The elites call it the Great Reset or Build Back Better or Green New Deal. The names change, but the goal remains the same. More power for the powerful and less freedom for everyone else. So the liberal media have been bought and paid for by Trudeau, and they've been pushing um, an even bigger government agenda. And it's a really sad day in Canada when even journalists call for Canadians to be censored on social media. Now we have a, a radical environmentalist as heritage minister who's become censor in chief. He's behind that Bill C-10. It, it's a proposed law that would ban many new streaming services from coming on board. He's behind upcoming legislation to have government censors regulate social media. And he's also planning to tax Google and Facebook every time you or I search for a news article online. So if companies like Google and Facebook face costs they can't control, they'll eliminate the potential to incur the cost by banning Canadians from being able to search or share news. Now, why do you think Trudeau would want Canadians to be unable to search or share news right as he's planning a snap election? <laughs> 